Brand new secret angels have entered the house and it's time for them to put their differences aside and fight together because today we're taking on the new demon floor tormented throne. Let's see if our angels are up for the task. So here we go guys, we've got our angel squad at the ready. We've got fallen angel, archangel, death angel and regular mythic angel here as well. But you know what? This team's looking a little bit too weak for my liking. I think we're gonna hit it with some epic curses and upgrades. You know what? I think that's looking just a little bit better. We've got nightmare curse on each of our heroes and level five all leveled up in damage. This is gonna be the most insane angel team you've ever seen. Right, but the challenge is to take on the demon floor, so let's see how they perform. Let me know in the comments if you think they're gonna wipe these guys. Let's go. So the goal here, guys, is to beat through all of the demon floor. I don't know if we can do it, but I'm hoping so. We've got 20 placements, so we're not gonna mess about. The demons don't play, so we're not gonna play either. The angels are here to save the day. Let me know down in the comments if you think the angel team is going to win. I'm feeling pretty confident, but you never know. So let's check how many placements in total. There's six and fives, 11. Okay, so we can get up to the 20 max heroes, which is important. Um, that's great to have. And this first one is pretty, it's a pretty small map. So we should be able to cover quite a lot of ground with these angels. Look at this guy. <laughs> Oh, Archangel's looking so good. So far, it's looking very divine out here. We've got the Archangel and the regular Angel. But Death Angel and Fallen Angel, they're going to come in and do their part as well. I think I could just go with these for now. This feels like it won't be too difficult. I've got five placement on these. Let me make sure I'm covering the door back here. Although the upgrades are probably... I don't know if it upgrades on range. we got to check that. So I'm going to... Oh, not you yet. Let's go with the Archangels first. Get our beam towers out nice and strong. We'll stick one right here. Oh, look at the squad, guys. It looks so good. Now, this is basically the strongest you can do in the angels, except for the fact that you could do it with shinies. So if you'd like to see a comparison with the shiny angel team, let me know in the comments as well. And of course, don't forget to leave your Roblox username down below if you want to win a Fallen Angel. I'm going to give away something every single episode. Alright, we've got some of the bigger enemies coming out here. Let's take a look. The Minotaurs, they are actually looking pretty spicy. I've upgraded quite a few on the team. I've got all my Angels out now. Let's start with the Angels first. Get those upgrades in. You know what? We're just going to go for all of them. Might be time to call in some Fallen Angels to help defend here, guys. Let's do it. Let's get our Fallen Angel squad out. Oh, it's looking so good, right? We can still get one more. Let's stick them in the middle. I was being really kind of like organized there, but yeah, I think it's time to just get the squad out. We're not messing about with these angels. We're here for the win, so let's get another two down the end. All right, there we go. So this squad is looking crazy. Look at the army of angels ready to defend. Right, but let's uh, again not play too much. We got a job to do here. Let me just get these upgrades. Keep focusing on the Fallen Angel. The AoE in the middle there is going to be epic, so let's get the Death Angels up. I have a feeling these guys are going to be super strong with all their upgrades, so I think we're going to be okay. Check it out, guys. It's peaceful. Oh, I thought I had all of the upgrades. Two more. There we go. But look at the beams go, guys. They are getting melted. How much health do these guys have when they're coming out? Because they're just they're just falling out. They're, they're gone. 100,000 yet yeah, wiped out. The squad is too powerful for room one, but I wonder how we're going to get on with room two, three, four, and five. Lots to go. And here we go. They think this boss is going to stop us. These angels have been melting. So I think we're going to be all right. Now we do have to keep an eye on the power-ups that the bosses do have in the demon floors. But these guys are going to melt once they hit it. Right, watch. Heroes are burning. Heroes are burning. Hellfire has hit. But we should still melt it quick enough. Come on, let's go. Melt that boss before we have to replace. Yeah, we're good. Check it out. There's the win. Time for room number two. So we've kicked it off with the divine angels again we've got the archangel regular angel and they are covering a lot of ground right here we've got two more angels to put out then we move into the darkness we go for the death angel and fallen angel but i feel like this is going to be all right hopefully i don't want to eat my words now but hopefully these guys can make it through room number two so we can keep on going through the floor lots of little demon spiders coming out not going to be too much of an issue but i gotta pay attention and i gotta be ready to upgrade let's keep kidding 
out this team. All right, there we go. 20 angels are on the field again. It is a mass of angels that are just defending this place. But the minotaurs are out, so I want to pay attention. I want to get some upgrades. Fallen angels, of course, are AoE. So they're focusing the uh, choke point in the center. Okay, so the squad is fully upgraded. We're on wave 7 out of 13. And it's probably going to heat up a little bit here. But you know what? I've got faith. They're all tier 5 now, ready to go. So I think the placement is okay. We're choking the top here with the AoE damage. We've got these epic beams. The range on these beams is just, it's huge for these type of rooms. I mean, 84 on the Archangel, speed 5, boost 1.2. Things are going really good in here. So let's have a look at these ones. Again, range 87, range 75. The angels are just, they can just reach as far as they want, which is epic for tight, small maps like this because everyone's a target. But yeah, I think we're going to make it. Let's see how we get on into the final rounds. The boss has spawned right at the back over here, so it shouldn't be much of an issue. Four million colossal demon king. So we gotta be wary that he does have hellfire. So what happens is he'll stomp like that. Your hero is burning and it's only a matter of time before that hero is now gone. So you need to replace it or yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna burn out. Wait, which one was that? It was a regular angel. You see that? Archangel's gone. You gotta pay attention. We've got this death angel. <laughs> Poor death angel's gone twice. Um, but I think we're gonna be all right. Look at the damage. We're kicking it up here. Lots of these guys are on fire, but we'll leave them go for now. Sorry, angels. You have been perished. You've perished to hellfire. But we do, of course, win this room. So let's keep going. We're on to room number three. So room number three is definitely a step up in the challenge. It is quite tight here, guys. The gap between some of the entrances and the exit is really close. So you gotta get some good towers in early. Uh, you can see lots of little demons coming out nice and fast. You want to make sure you're getting some damage out there quick to defend because they're quick as well. They can get around to this entrance like in no time. So I'm going to get my Archangels on the side here. We're going to get as much defense in as possible. I think we're going to be all right from there. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to choke the sides, I think, with the Fallen Angels because they have to, anywhere that enemies have to go to is always a great place for an AoE terror like this. So any enemy that comes from here or either of those two has to walk past this section, which means great for AoE. So we're going to stick two Fallen Angels there, two on this side, and we might stick one again. They all have to go here, so one at the entrance there. Uh, Death Angels can probably start kicking up some damage nice and early on the entrances down there, so let's do that. One, two. How many have we placed? We placed 15. Let's get to 20. We need to place one more Archangel. Uh, where are you going to go? You know what? Again, you can balance in the middle here with your friend. Look, it's like a little team in the middle. Wait, look how far they're going. No, no, no. Okay, I gotta stop placing. I gotta get some... Oh, I gotta get more upgrades going. You see, I was going too slow. You can't go slow in this map. You have to pay complete attention. I had money. I wasn't spending it. I nearly lost because of it. So let's let's get some upgrades done. Okay, now it's feeling a little bit better. We've got our full 20 out of 20 down on the field. I do believe they're all tier 5 upgraded. We're on to wave 8. Oof, you cannot take your eyes off this one for a minute. The demon floor does not mess about. But let's see what we've got here. We've got Shadow Demon in. we got these creepy crawlies coming out as well. And Colossal Demons with 350,000 health. And it's from here to here. It's a little stroll to the exit. you got to be so careful. I think I'm covered pretty well. Like the Archangels on the, the highest upgrade. Like I said, the range is super big. We've got some Fallen Angels to do some crazy damage here. 44,800. Obviously, it's boosted and has 0.33 speed. So not too bad. It's great when they're all clumped together like that. So they're getting more action in this map for sure because there's a lot of choke points. It's okay, mister. What are you doing that for? There's no one there. He's getting too excited. But let's go and see how we get on down to the boss wave. I'm excited to get in to Tormentus Throne. I wonder if we can make it. All right, things are definitely heating up here onto wave 14. They're getting a little bit closer and I'm slightly worried because I don't think there's much I can do in order of changing tower placements. I think we gotta run with this setup. I'm really hoping we can make it. Okay, Ooh, we made it to wave 15 at least. So this is where it gets really interesting because if the boss does obviously get close enough to use Hellfire and send all my terrors to perish, he's going to be able to hit so many of them. Where is he starting? Okay, here he is. 5.5 million. Hopefully the team can wipe out all of these other enemies to start getting damage on that boss before he gets too close to everyone. All right, come on. Get get rid of them. Get rid of them. Quick, 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 quick. Get rid of these demon imps. No, 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 no. Oh, Hellfire has begun. Right, so I'm going to start with you, Death Angel. You're going to... What else? There's an Archangel 
angel there. I think I lost a fallen angel there, so I'm gonna get you. But it's if he gets in the center here and does that, that's where the real danger is. Okay, all right. He's yeah. Look, he's reaching so many of them. They're all on fire. But look at the health, guys. That is going down so fast because the rest of the squad is getting involved. They've perished. <laughs> but it's okay because I think we're heading on to room number four. Check it out. And he's gone. We got some voodoo tokens. All right, let's go room number four. Okay, everybody, welcome to the library. This one is an interesting one. It's a much bigger, wider map, and you can actually shoot through these bookcases at the minute, so I still think the placement is best off here in the center because of their range. So as you can see, when they when they start out, it doesn't cover a lot compared to the other maps, but if you get some upgrades going, look at that. You're covering so much ground. So I think that's my move. Again, don't want to waste time. Got to get any upgrades. So this one only has 14 waves. It is is one shorter and I do believe the final map is even shorter again but it is chaos so I think we're fully upgraded I think we're ready to go we've got our boosts again these doors are pretty close to the exits you gotta keep an eye on them but yeah this is a pretty cool map pretty long and obviously you can run back in we defeated you already so we're in here doing all our work we're making our way to Tormentus himself in room number five what do we think is gonna happen though I'm hoping we can make this a full-on win but but let's wait and see. All right, guys, not too much trouble so far, but we are into wave 13 and there's quite a lot of health coming down the track. I'm hoping my guys have got what it takes to take these out. These beams are not focusing. Okay, there we go. Oh, guys, you gotta pay attention to the exit there. You see, it targets whichever's gonna hit it first. That's why these guys are going faster currently, but this is getting overwhelming. Wait, are we gonna win this? Angels, don't let me down now. We're so close to Tormentus. No way, no way, no way. It's so close. Wait, hold on, we've got Colossal demons there. Where's the boss? Where's the boss? Oh, this is dangerous. Is this as far as our angel team really goes? I had so much faith, but I'm not gonna give up just yet. This could be really tight. All right, get rid of those demon imps. Get back on the big ones. Yeah, they're getting melted. As soon as they get targeted, they get melted, which is great. So that gives me faith because they are quite slow, but where is the boss? Is he? Oh, he's in there. Look, there he is. Okay, he didn't turn and he's got six and a half million, which means if we can... Okay, heroes are burning. Heroes are burning. We have to pay attention to this right now. I can't mess with the heroes burning, guys. If if I... No, 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 no. If I lose all of these, we're in big trouble. I need to make sure I'm getting them upgraded. They all just went. Did you see that? No way. Oh, no. How many... Okay, it's all the archangels. I need to get as much damage out as possible. I cannot waste time here. More are perishing. More are perishing. I've got five more towers to place. No, 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 no. Don't do this. Okay, his health is going down. I'm feeling okay. I'm feeling all right. That was scary, though. I thought we were going to lose it. He's, he's taking out all of my terrors. Oh, Tormentus is gonna be tough. All right, I think we got him, though. Oh, we did. Oh, we got the pet. How cool is that? I got the pet, and I got a mystery urn, which is a shiny. So that pet is epic. Yes, but we're going into Tormentus throne, the final map. Thumbs up if you're enjoying the video. Let's go do it. All right, guys, here we go. It is about to begin. We're gonna pay good attention to what we're gonna do here. This is a straight line track beaming down the middle. Lots of entrances for the enemy. Enemies, so oh, we got it. We just got to pay attention really really put it to them And this entrance at the start is pretty dangerous So we don't want to go too high up the map But you know what I think because Archangel has such a good range We can afford to go a little bit maybe like there and then just focus on upgrading this one first So that yeah, so it gets back down to these tracks as well So this is gonna be able to reach all the way at the top all the way at the back It might be a better option for these as well. You know what? I think it is We're, we get the money to spare Let's move them move them forward and make sure sure they can focus everything that's needed. Uh, I'm gonna go with this one here. Just in case they get down the track before he gets targeted, that'd be pretty dangerous. So yeah, we're gonna focus Archangels first, um, get the upgrades going. We'll go with some Fallen Angels at the top like this. We're gonna go with some in the... M oh, no, they're gonna go in defense actually as well, because these guys are great at dealing a lot of damage if anything gets to that choke point. And this area is where every single one of them has to go. So let's go with that. Let's again get, uh, get our towers on the field. Uh, let's go with Death Angels in the middle. I think focusing this middle area with 
long range is gonna be our move. I hope so anyway, and then we'll go back here. All right, so we're gonna focus on upgrades now. We're on wave five. This is quick, but it is pretty intense, and Tormentus himself is the one we gotta watch out for. So let's go. Let's get some upgrades going. All right, there it is, the fully upgraded team. We've got our fallen angels in defense. We've also got our two fallen angels up top, ready to attack in the assault mode, and then we've got our archangels beaming from the center, along with the death and regular angels. So I like this setup. I'm hoping it's good enough. Tormentus himself will be coming soon. And yeah, there's a lot of demon power coming out here. Can we do it? Wave 7 out of 10. This is it. The final room. The final floor currently. And I'm hoping we can make this happen. Look at this guy. Oh, he's spooky. Now, he does have a another power up that we gotta be careful of and we gotta keep an eye on. Alright, you know what? We gotta pay attention. These are the colossal demons. These guys have a million health. They're coming out from every entrance and more from the back. Oh yeah, right. This is why it gets intense. But so far the angels are doing their job. These guys are up getting that damage in early because there is quite a bulk of enemies that come from the top. So it's nice to have these starting the um, damage early, especially with these slow ones. They're going to get hit a good few times by the AoE. Yeah, that's, that's really nice. And then the angels back here are focusing. Wait, wave 10 already. Oh, this is they overload us with demons. Just so Tormentus can make it out. 8 million health and moves pretty quick. Wait, he's chosen my hero. No way, guys. I forgot they could do that as well. This is going to be crazy. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this. We need our archangels. We need to focus our archangels. All right, get archangels out. Archangels are out. Archangels, we need you. Everything is burning. Everything is burning. Oh, these guys have 5 million health, guys. No, 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 no. I need to just keep placing the, the main guys so far. These ones first, right? I know you're burning. I know you're burning. I wonder if I put them further out. Will they still burn? I think they will, right? I've only got one archangel out at the minute. No way. I need to place them. <laughs> these colossals are going crazy. <laughs> guys, it's so intense. Can I do this? I, I I don't know yet. I mean, we're doing okay, I think. I think. Um, until that happens, every one of my heroes just got wiped out. But I think we're nearly on to Tormentus. No, no. Keep going. Keep going. No, don't place over there. He's after choosing my archangel. Luckily, we've got the money to keep replenishing this. It's so important right now. We need to do get these fallen angels in the center here before Tormentus comes down. Death angels. Right, he's, he, he can keep lighting them. That's fine. That's fine. I'd rather he chose the single attack than the um, lighting everybody on fire. That one is so tough. Right. But this is actually pretty quick how fast he sends us to the underworld. Oh, come on. 3.8. Hey, can it happen? 2.9. Come on. We need it. Please don't let Tormentus get in. Oh, it's so tight. We did it. We defeated Tormentus with the Angel team. But how intense was that, guys? That was wild. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that challenge. That was pretty insane near the end there. And I want to say a quick congratulations to Rafosa2019 for winning a Fallen Angel from the last episode. The comment is on screen right now. Guys, comment your username down below if you want to win one of these fallen angels and I'll be back very soon for some more. Bye guys!